How's it going everyone? John here and welcome back to another Streamlabs OBS tutorial video. Today's video I'm going to be talking about how to use the Streamlabs Stream Deck type of software. Now it's not like the Elgato software where you have like a Stream Deck. It's more so just mainly using just Streamlabs and this is really good for those who are only using one monitor and it allows you to still access all of your scenes and everything at a press of a button very similar to a Stream Deck. So if you don't have a Stream Deck you're only working on one monitor. You know, this is a really good workaround for you guys. And I'm going to show you how to set all that up here in this video. Now, if you do use multiple monitors or you have a stream deck, this video probably doesn't really apply to you. So I'm just letting you guys know that out of the gate, but you can still stick around if you want to try to see if this might be something for you. So let's go ahead and get started. So what you're going to do, log in, go down to your settings, and you're going to go over to remote control. Now here it's going to ask you, to scan the QR code. Now before you go and do that, just make sure that you are already on the latest version of the Streamlabs mobile app. If you don't have that already on your phone, go ahead and download that and also download a QR scanner on your smartphone. Once you have that, I'm gonna go and bring you into the application and it's not really the best quality, unfortunately, but this little doohickey over here, it's free. You do, you know, you work with what you got. Um, but basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on the uh, thing right here and you're gonna take your phone and you're gonna try to scan it. So boom, now that you have it scanned, you're in the program and this is now gonna be all of your scenes. So you guys can't see me, but I'm not gonna press on anything here. I'm just gonna press it on my phone. So as you can tell though, you have it where it shows go live. You can start recording. You have all of your different scenes and everything like that. So if I wanted to go to my be right back screen, I'll go ahead and I'll do that. Let me go and minimize that and we'll move this guy over here. So I'm gonna click on BRB and I didn't even press anything on the screen. I did it all on my phone. And same thing with like my sources. So if you guys look down over here where it shows my mic and auxiliary or whatever, you see how it's got it muted. So I'm gonna go and click on that. And now you can see that I'm talking and everything is picking up. So this is a really great useful tool, like I said, for anyone who is wanting to only use one monitor or you guys are liking the idea of having like a tablet that has all of your scenes and everything right there in front of you and just makes it really useful for you. Now, there's some limitations to customization on here as always, because you are limited to what you can do in the Streamlabs software. If you're wanting to go beyond that, then you are gonna wanna get an Elgato Stream Deck, which I have a bunch of videos on as well that do kind of go into pretty good detail on what you can do with the Stream Deck. But I figured I would bring this to your guys' attention to help you guys out. I know I get a lot of people asking me about what they can do with a one monitor setup. And I figured this would be a great workaround. But if I miss anything, if you guys have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. If this is your first time here, be sure to go ahead and take a look at the other content on the channel. There's a lot of videos that go over the technical side of streaming. And if you're enjoying that content, make sure you guys subscribe, click the bell, like the video, and make sure you follow me on my social media networks. Join the Discord, and you guys can also catch me over on Twitch. So be sure to go ahead and follow me over there as well. But I'll see you guys in a future video, future stream. Thanks so much for watching and take care.